2023 will surely be remembered as a momentous year. From the end of the pandemic, the unfortunate continuation of conflicts in Ukraine and Sudan, as well as the onset of a major humanitarian crisis in Turkey and Syria, Four Paws has been there along the way, advocating for animal welfare worldwide. With over 880 team members in 14 countries, and with 11 sanctuaries and partner projects for more than 270 rescued bears and big cats, Four Paws has spent 2023 continuing to be the global animal welfare organization for animals under human influence. We began this year by responding to one of the most severe natural catastrophes in recent history, the earthquakes in Turkey and Syria, which claimed over 50,000 lives. Four Paws dispatched an emergency relief team to help animals in the most affected regions, delivering over 125.5 tons of animal feed, performing medical procedures on over 50 animals, and saving thousands more from certain death. We continued our work in conflict zones in Ukraine. Together with our local partners, we reopened veterinary clinics to support pets and strays by providing vaccinations, sterilizations, and other necessary medical treatments. In Europe, Four Paws' stray animal care teams were also active in Romania, Bulgaria, Moldova, and Kosovo, where we have sterilized and vaccinated over 11,350 stray dogs and cats. In Southeast Asia, we performed more than 2,500 sterilizations and nearly 7,000 vaccinations. We have continued our fight against the dog and cat meat trade and hit an incredible milestone. Two million of our supporters have signed the petition. And in Vietnam, we launched the Run for Millions, a virtual run event for dogs and cats. Nearly 17,000 people ran a staggering 2.6 million kilometers in support of ending the gruesome dog and cat meat trade. In the Western Hemisphere, wildlife advocates and supporters gathered in Lower Manhattan to celebrate a new three-story mural by artist Sani Sundancer. Four Paws commissioned this work as part of our Break the Vicious Cycle campaign, which calls for the end of the commercial trade of big cats in South Africa. Four Paws also returned to Argentina to rescue two neglected tigers from an illegal breeding farm in Balcarce, near Buenos Aires. Local authorities reached out to Four Paws for help, and our expert team rescued Fanjo and Charlie, taking them to Almawa for Nature and Wildlife, a cooperation project between the Princess Alia Foundation and Four Paws in Jordan. Back in Vietnam, Although we have been working to end ball bear farming for good, more than 200 bears are still kept in cages for ball extraction. Bear Na suffered on a farm for over two decades, until Four Paws rescued and took her to Bear Sanctuary Nin Bin, where we are making sure Na receives all the treatment and care she so urgently needs. Another victim of the ruthless wild animal trade is Charlotta, her crossed eyes serve as a poignant reminder of inbreeding, which results in serious health issues. After Czech authorities confiscated her, temporarily keeping her at a zoo, they asked Four Paws to find a more species-appropriate place for her. She is now getting special medical training from our team at Tiaat Wild Animal Sanctuary in Germany. Four Paws Sustainable Sanctuaries celebrated three anniversaries in 2023, a Rosa Bear Sanctuary in Switzerland celebrated its fifth, Bear Sanctuary Pristina in Kosovo celebrated its tenth, and Bear Sanctuary Abesbach its 25th anniversary this year. Over 100 medical procedures were performed on animals in Four Paws care at our sanctuaries. We continued our tradition of joining climate strikes across the globe to call for an end to factory farming. In the world of fashion, after years of pressure, Four Paws finally won its campaign calling Nike to end their use of mules' cheap wool. With Four Paws' support, the European Citizens' Initiative, or ECI, petition for a fur-free Europe collected over 1.5 million signatures this year. 20 member states have already banned fur farming on grounds of animal welfare and public health.
2023 was a challenging year. The interconnected well-being of people, animals and our planet has never been more apparent. Thanks to your loyal and generous support, despite these tough and distressing times, growth and development have made Four Paws a leading global player in animal welfare. Together, we can create a world where animals are treated with respect, empathy and understanding. As 2023 comes to its close, we wish you all the best for the end of the year and for a healthy, happy and successful 2024. Let us keep caring for animals and their welfare worldwide. Picking highlights for this video has been tough. Because fortunately, what you see here is just an excerpt of all the amazing ways we helped animals this year. At the same time, we know all too well that there is still much work to be done. But we want to let you know that we are ending 2023 on a high note, with one of our biggest and most complex rescue missions to date. At the end of November, Four Paws returned to Sudan for the urgent evacuation of nearly 50 wild animals from the high conflict escalation zone in the south of Khartoum. Sadly, not all the animals survived. But those that did received veterinary care and were relocated to a temporary safe zone in Wad Madani, Umbarona National Park, where they can recover from their injuries and regain their strength. A meaningful end to this momentous year, 2023.